Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Drifting Dreamers 5. Today, we're here on the landing and we're making some progress, getting some things done. We're gonna be building a fire pit and the boys are trimming up some wood. It's gonna be a pretty exciting morning. We're gonna be diving in to the, to the shed, getting the shed pulled all out and reorganized because one of you awesome subscribers have reached out and sent us something else. It's a huge benefit. It's gonna be huge for the channel, huge for our homestead. Thank you so much. Same subscriber who sent the gorilla cart. We love you so much. Let me show you guys what the boys are up to. Morning, Jacob. <laughs> Jacob is out here with this cedar log right here, taking the, the loppers to it, chopping it down, cleaning it up a little bit. And Talon is actually over here with the little six inch mini chainsaw that uh, is mommy's. <laughs> and you are going to town, huh? Yeah. Doing a pretty good job. <laughs> Is it a little scary learning how to use it? Uh, not really. Not too bad? Yeah. Yeah. You're, uh, you've been learning how to use things here and there since we've, uh, since we've started our little adventure. I think you're getting a lot better. Yeah. Well, I don't, uh, go ahead and give us a little demonstration. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Not too bad. Yeah. This is going to go straight to the burn pile. With all of our cardboard, we're about to start the fire right here and get our bricks going around. Jacob also had the rake and he raked all this up. Hey son, don't worry about that part. Look at this. Mm -hmm. Let me see it. We'll go ahead and actually we can cut this off about right here. And just so you guys know, it's not because he's not holding it tight enough and it's jumping around. This thing is just kicking a little bit. And we need to adjust the chain. Jacob was trying to cut this big old one right here and told him to let Talon put that little saw to it. Go ahead, son. Yep, there you go. There you go. Good job, son. Here, we'll pull it out and throw it in the fire pit. We're getting ready to start this fire pit. Matter of fact, Jacob, you ready to start the fire pit and get to burning? While Jacob and Talon work on the fire pit area and getting all these boxes and everything burned, I'm gonna start coming over here to the bricks and blocks and start grabbing some of these bricks and blocks, putting them in the gorilla cart, bring them over, and then we're gonna get us a nice border going around this fire pit.
<laughs> I don't know if you're gonna be able to pull that, son. Woo, you gotta put some back into that. Right, I'll get it. Here, let me pull it. If it was flat ground, you'd probably be able to pull it a lot easier. Here, why don't you trade me? <laughs> Ready? Mm. Oh! Oh yeah, this is heavy. Not too far. Let's go ahead and get it set up. Woo! Good job, Talon. He cleaned up that pine, uh, that cedar log pretty nicely. All right, next up, Talon, is this one over here. Gonna clean this one up as well. Oh, that one should come off nice and easy. So we're gonna need a couple of more blocks to make it all the way around the circle. And we have acquired another helper today. Hi. I think we're only gonna need maybe a, we're probably not gonna need that many. Maybe like three or four blocks. We'll just take like four blocks. Pull it on around, son. Pull it up a little more. There you go. All right, let's load it up. All right, Talon has wore out the uh, mini electric chainsaw. How do you feel about using it today? It was pretty good. Pretty good? Like this. Nice. Yeah, we got well, you, uh, you did pretty good so far. I guess you're going to go ahead and get inside and get us some water? Yeah. Nice. Why don't you look in the cabinet and you can get that really cool uh, bass fish cup that the subscriber made for me. And if you'll fill that up for me, that'd be great. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, son. Nice. Serenity and Jacob's already got one block in. You guys gonna fill this one up or you want me to do it? No, we got it. All right. <laughs> Disclosure, this is not <laughs> child labor. <laughs> no matter what you see. <laughs> All right, two more. <laughs> yeah, two more should get it. Pull it up a little. When you pull it, Serenity can push it from the back and make it a little easier. Teamwork, teamwork, teamwork. Good job, Jake. Uno mas. Uno mas. Uno dos tres cuatro. Muy bien. Cuatro. We need. Uno mas. Uno. We need uno. Good job. Uno. Yeah, help him grab it. Whoop. Found a hole to fill. There you go. All right. <laughs> Victory dance, huh, Serenity? <laughs> All right. 
Y'all get this over here and I will get it back around. Looks like Serenity is doing most of the work. <laughs> this is what we got so far, guys. I know it's not a perfect circle, but we're gonna straighten her on up, get her rolling, and we'll see what happens. Excuse me. Good job, son. Good job, baby. Thank you. All right, <laughs> final product guys. We got a nice little block uh, ring. That should make a make everybody feel a little bit more comfortable. What do you think, Serenity? Good. How do you like it? Not amazing. <laughs> How did you do? Good. Yeah. Ten out, ten out of ten. All right, on to the next project. Thank you, sir, for your help. No problem. All right, next up is going to be cleaning up this area right here. Getting all these small sticks and limbs and stuff like that. We're going to pick all this stuff up and get it cleaned up. I want to be able to get around this back of this area so all this stuff right here is going to get cleaned up as well that way we can pull the cart through there all right we're going to be picking it up and jumping it in the fire pit over there and while you guys are working on this i'm going to go ahead and start pulling stuff out of the shed all right guys while the kids are going to do that i've already started i'm going to go ahead and finish pulling everything out of here everything's kind of been just tossed in here a little bit and we're going to go ahead and pull everything out and get it all nice and organized. And uh, finally, maybe even get our wrenches and stuff put in our drawers. I haven't even done that. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Blue Eddie. Let's get to pulling stuff out. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars. Mm. Maybe the birds will sing about your heart. Maybe the trees will whisper the word. Maybe the sun will spread your joy to the ones who lost their hope. Well guys, lunchtime's over. How we had some nice Chinese food that we had from last night, some good leftovers. And hey, big shout out to Lynn's Chinese Buffet in Boonville uh, for right at about 50 bucks. We had enough food for the five of us last night for dinner and for today at lunch. So that was a heck of a deal. Let's go ahead and check on the kids and see what they're up to because guess what guys, the fire's already burned down. Sorry for the generator noise guys. Don't know how good you could hear it, but here's the fire pit. It's already burned down pretty good. Let's go ahead and stack some more of that back up there, get it rolling. Got some more wood, pile of leaves. One thing at a time, guys. Getting everything pulled out. Oh, check this out. This is so awesome. Let me show you guys. So one of Jacob's Christmas presents I got him this year was a BB gun. And uh He's been sitting up out here. He's done set up a little a little shooting range and he's got some cans up here. Look at this, he's been tearing them up. 
Come on with it, son. Tear them up. We sat out here for about 10, 15 minutes, uh, going over it, looking down the iron sights, lining everything up. But he has already had uh, some good experience with firearms before, so it didn't take too long before he got right back into it. He has shot uh, 22s, um, a shotgun, a, I think a nine millimeter, and a couple of other pew pews, but he has some good experience. We'll get him comfortable with this before we put him up another notch or so. And you know what's next, 22 action. So you can see the, the cord that goes into the window right there. Ah, uh, welcome inside the tiny house, guys, for the first time since Christmas. Do the whole place. <laughs> Tyler and Jacob said they're doing a role play. Tyler yeah. bought this Star Wars thing. Yeah. Tyler, continue reading. Because of the thing I got yesterday. So I was able to buy a Star Wars thing. Just wanted to stop in and show you guys that uh, oh, Tyler and Jacob are uh, playing the PlayStation. One's on the PS5, one's on the PS4. And we are using the EcoFlow and the uh, Vitam and Flash Speed 1500 that we just got. So we that one charge. Hey, I told you guys, we really do use these things. And check that out, that's pretty cool. The box is upside down, but that's the Vitamin Flash Speed 1500 solar panels. Do you guys remember when I did the review of it and I joked around about there being solar panels available and I was like, hey guys, why didn't you send me some panels? They sent me an email and said, they, they sent me an email and said, you know what, the joke was pretty funny. We don't know why we didn't send the solar panels in the first place. Here's your, here's your set, go ahead and get them. And guess what guys, I think they're even going to hook one of you awesome viewers and subscribers up with a brand new Vitamin Flash Speed 1500. I'm still working up, uh, working out the details with them, but they said all I gotta do is do a, a quick little integration with the solar panels behind me and they will work out the details where I can somehow do another drawing or something like that and we will be able to hook one of you guys up with a Vitamin Flash Speed 1500. I think that'd be, I think that would be real cool. But back to work, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and stir the fire pit around a little bit, get it flamed back up, and then I'm gonna finish pulling everything out of the shed. I gotta go up to the gate. There's something big up there, something huge. It's coming up. I'm so excited. Might as well go ahead and get that gorilla cart. Here we go. There we go. I mean, I guess I could carry this, but why? All right, I was about to go ahead and put it up there, but I seen Jacobs back out here playing sniper. You got one right there and then one in the back. Have you been able to hit both these targets already? Yeah. All right, I let's shot from right there. Man. All right, well, let's see if you can do it. Here we go, guys. No pressure, Jacob. Oh, nice. I seen it move. Good job, son. The back one? That one, no, that one. Are you going to try to knock it down? Yeah. Nice. You shot it again. It just didn't take it down. Yeah, that, that happens sometimes. That happens sometimes? Yeah, oh, that one missed. Well, you keep practicing, son. You're doing really good. Okay. Let's go ahead and get the big boy inside. This one's 
I got an idea. Huh? Working smarter, not harder? That's what you like to see, right? And the solar panels. Now that I got all those boxes out of here, I got a lot more room in here now. I'm gonna go ahead and clean this area up a little bit, pour some more, pull some more stuff out of here, straighten this up a little bit, and then I can bring some more stuff in here and start to organize it. I might have to put everything back in here, guys, and then go to the gate. We are running out of time and running out of light. It'll be dark in about 35 minutes. Let's go ahead and see what we can get done. Uh-oh, the waiters, huge shout out to Tim with Ridge Life. Go Ridge Life. This thing came in so handy when I took it fishing. All right, guys, I think the next thing I'm gonna do is go, to go ahead and bring all my shovels and everything back in here and put them in this corner first. Let's uh, get some light rolling. Uh-oh, you see the blue LEDs? I don't remember, uh, I don't know if you guys remember seeing these or not. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and get all of our shovels back in here. I'm gonna go ahead and clean this off also so I can bring the chainsaw and put everything back in here again. Oh, look at here. Here's uh, Lissa's bird feeder she had got a while ago. Put bird seed in it. We never had one bird come in there. Have to figure out a good spot on the landing to put it in. We're running out of time, guys. Let's get it done. Well guys, I think this is going to be officially my tool shed. Well, won't be using this one for a while. The old electric Ryobi still ready to rock and roll. I just got to sharpen a blade on it. Probably need to go ahead and get a new one. It's been on there for a while. Oh yeah, don't forget. I got a case for this. A case. A case. A case. A case, just in case. Be safety. Now, where are you going to put this, Daddy? There was three, and I chose the one that I was thinking next to yours. So I'm probably going to go ahead and just bring everything back in here. Now that I got these boxes out of here, I really would like to bring my black toolbox in here and lay it up against this back wall, and then I could put more stuff into the black toolbox. But for now, since we're losing light, I'm gonna go ahead and just bring everything back in here, kind of set it up nicely, and then we'll get a chance to rearrange everything in here. Now that I know 100% this is gonna be my tool shed. <laughs> Iro ironic, I couldn't find my little one gallon gas can, so I had listed to buy another one. The new one, guess what? I found the old one. 
small little gas cans are going to be for two cycle gas only. Hey, at least it is semi-organized. Gary, Junk to Gems 3, I need to get my straps back. I am never gonna remember on my own. <laughs> so I'm on my way down to the gate right now, guys. I'm on my way to pick up the next big thing for Dreamers Landing. This is really gonna change the game for us a little bit more. We're so excited for it. Thank you so much again. We're gonna use the initials JP. You're so amazing. This is uh, the same person who sent us the Gorilla Cart, sent us this. Thank you so much. Oh, check out the creek right here. I'll open the door for you. Let you see. The creek is back, guys. Show you how deep it is. I wonder if it'll come over the running board. So the creek is back, but it's not over the running board. And I am right in the middle of the creek, guys. We're right in the middle. Now we're out. Let's go get it. Dang, I'm so excited guys. Woo wee. Look at that. Let's go check it out. Before I spin around and show you guys what it is, I'm gonna give you an opportunity to drop it down below in the comment section. What do you think is so absolutely amazing? It's so gonna help us so much, really open up some space. Well, there it is. I'll give you guys a hint. There's four boxes that it comes in. And uh, well, you may have seen, you may have seen me put this together once before. Oh, it's another 10 by 10 metal garden shed, guys. Dang! Oh. JP, we really do appreciate it. Thank you so much. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year's. You have, you have done way more than what we deserve you to do. Thank you, thank you so much. I'm gonna go ahead and pull the truck up. I'm gonna empty the garbage over here into the dumpster. Then I'm gonna grab this and load it into the back of the truck. Time to finish this video up, guys. Ooh, I don't even know if you guys can see that. One, two, three, four boxes. Let's get on back down to the house. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up tonight. Liz is still not feeling good. She is right over there behind you guys laying down in bed. She did just finish editing this video for us. And uh, well, you'll actually seeing this one before you'll be seeing that one. <laughs> so this is like looking into the past a little bit. But I hope y'all had a wonderful day. Thanks a lot for hanging out with us again. You guys go chase your dreams because we're chasing ours. Remember, if you can dream it, you can drift it. Bye.